Hi everyone, welcome to Alex Maxi. In today's video, we're gonna be getting rid of mouth wrinkles and parentheses. If you find that your wrinkles are getting a little pronounced and you find that your laugh lines tend to get deeper, which is causing you to look much older, I have a wonderful solution for you. So if you're interested, come with me in the kitchen and I'll show you how to make this in no time. Now the first thing I'm going to do, I'm going to prepare the aloe vera gel and I'm going to use about a ounce of the aloe vera gel. If you have fresh aloe vera, use it like I'm using here. If not, go ahead and use your store-bought aloe vera gel. So to extract the gel from the hollow leaf, I'm just going to cut both sides like I'm showing here. Just cut. It's pretty easy to do. And you can also choose to extract the aloe, blend it, and store it in your refrigerator for about seven days. Now here we have our aloe vera gel. And next, I'm gonna blend, so I'm just gonna put the gel in the blender. Do not add any water to this. Just go ahead and blend as is. Now once the aloe vera gel is blend, we're just gonna pour it out. And this is what it looks like. And now we're gonna combine the other ingredients. So I'm gonna be using one tablespoon of baking soda. Remember baking soda is the same as sodium bicarbonate or bicarbonate of soda. Now once we have the baking soda in the bowl, you're gonna make sure to get rid of any lumps that might be in the baking soda. So just mix the baking soda before you add the other ingredients. So now I have gotten rid of all the lumps. So moving on to the next ingredient. So I'm gonna add one teaspoon of fresh aloe vera gel, one teaspoon of coconut oil. If you have the liquid coconut oil, just use about a teaspoon and a half, okay? And now we're gonna blend and slowly blend, mix well, no rush, take your time. You gotta make sure that the coconut oil is completely blended with the aloe vera gel and the baking soda. And it need to be soft, it don't need to be dry. And this do have a wonderful Fragrant. You could smell the coconut oil. Once you're using good coconut oil, you could tell this smells amazing. And now our baking soda, coconut oil, aloe vera facial scrub is ready to use. Now I'm going to show you how to use this for best result. Now before you apply your exfoliator to the skin, you want to make sure to stir it. You're waking the coconut oil up, okay? So just mix well and then it is ready to use. Now before you apply the exfoliator to the skin, I would suggest that you start with clean skin. So make sure to get rid of any makeup, any grease that you might have on your skin. So wash your face like you normally do and then you're ready for the facial scrub. So you're gonna take a little of the facial scrub, not a lot. You're gonna place it in your hands like I'm showing here. And you're just gonna rub it in your hands. Now what is gonna happen when you rub this in your hands? Take a look. It's almost as if it totally disappear in your hands. Now you're gonna just exfoliate your skin with this facial scrub. So there you have it. Thank you all for watching Alex Maxi. Now if this was the first time watching, don't leave without subscribing. Look below, you're gonna see the word subscribe. Just click on it and you will be subscribed. Also at the side, there's a little bell. If you click on that, you will get a notification as soon as I upload a video. Thank you all for watching and I'll see you next time on Alex Maxi.